To close out the Cultivate Conference, Ag Week publisher Katie Pinky moderated an angry farmer panel to talk with three area growers about what frustrates them about ag technology and what they hope to gain from it. What frustrates you more and makes you an angry farmer with ag tech? When every acre and every minute counts, um, I, I always want to make sure I'm partnering with companies that have the best service and the best teams that can help me get, get back up and running as fast as possible. There's so many sensors, there's so many electronics. These things are sitting outside dealerships and, and snow is on them, rain's on them. All these problems are happening to all these electronics and they're trying to find where is the sensor. They're going down the wire with a, an electronic meter to see where it's at and it's like, are you kidding me? Like, we should be going right now. My friend had a brand new combine and it, it, it somehow it got a boundary on the map and it wouldn't combine or wouldn't record outside this map. And, and of course he calls the t tech support center, well we've never had that happen before. Or he called, you know, and they went higher up, well we've never had that happen before. I said that gotta happen all the time. So my catchphrase is technology is great dot 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 when it works. And, and if it doesn't work, there's nothing more frustrating. What do you want that you don't have? The infrared temperature sensor, you know, I want one that you can go down the row right after you plant, tells you uh, how deep it is, how far apart it is, whether the points of the corner up or down. I want ways to make the farm more money that can be put into equity because it's, there's a lot of farm equity out there. And as of right now, looking to the future, um, there's, there's a huge gap in how the, us in the next generation are going to be able to, to live and breathe this just like our dads and grandfathers have. Do you feel that farmers have a voice in the ag tech world? I guess I do, but it's, it kind of seems like it's after, after this technology has came out. Now we're ready to talk to you guys. What problems did you have? Well, maybe if you came to us before, you might have a better opportunity of, of solving some of these things before it happens. So lastly, how can egg tech companies build long-term relationships with farmers? It's too, too much in the egg industry as a whole with the big egg comps out there. They work for shareholders and we want to work with companies that work for farmers. The Angry Farmer Panel. <laughs> <laughs>